the name Parallel 49 Brewing came about because it's uh, the border between Canada and the US and we thought it was a name that would allow us to distribute beer both in Canada and the United States and it would be meaningful to, to both markets. And from the start we wanted the brewery to be big. We saw other breweries uh, with size limitations. The demand in Vancouver was very strong and we wanted to meet that demand. Uh, so we wanted to be a big brewery uh, right away. Yeah, we have a pretty lighthearted approach when it comes to beer. Uh, our branding uh, is very cartoony and, and fun. The names are crazy and uh, we, we work like that at the brewery all the time. So we're constantly pranking each other and uh, you know, putting each other on, on labels, on, on bottles and basically uh, whatever entertains us, we do it. So if you get laughed at sometimes, that's just kind of the way it is and you return the favor uh, when you can. Well, brewing beer is not too difficult. It's the packaging that's always the, the real pain to, to get it done. So uh, we're very happy with our, our new filler. Uh, we achieved very low dissolved oxygen in our bottle. And what that did for us is maintain that hop quality of aroma and flavor that we have in our tanks and get it into the bottle and keep that aroma on the shelf for the consumer to have. So we, we've met really good results. Uh, it, surpassed our expectations on the, the dissolved oxygen content. Yeah, uh, another thing we noticed uh, with the filler is uh, we're running 200 bottles a minute and every bottle has a consistent fill height. Uh, we produce a nitrogen beer that uh, the pressure in the bottle varies with the, the fill height. So we can't have any variations. With the new line, uh, every fill height is the same and then we get a consistent pressure which uh, we need for a consistent product. Okay, well right now, uh, craft beer is exploding in Vancouver and everywhere in North America. Everyone's making some very exciting new beers and I believe it's here to stay. Uh, the biggest thing is making sure everyone makes quality beer. You don't want to send out any bad products and dismay anyone from trying the craft beer. So I think, I think we've got a, a long while before craft beer goes away. Crumbs one sentence, okay. I'm gonna say uh, precision German engineering uh, with a high quality product. Uh, couldn't be happier. Thank <laughs> you.